the Sports Vote Campaign Podcast. Invest in sports. Hello and welcome back. Today is Sunday, October 31st, 2021, and this is It All Began in the 70s, Episode 9. So I remember the first time that I saw the movie, uh, Forrest Gump, I was uh, shocked by the images of the uh, character Forrest Gump with the braces on his legs. This is something that I had forgotten about, but when I was um, very young, you know, I think uh, like less than five years old, because I was uh, born, I think, with a twisted foot, at least that's what it was explained to me as, I was actually put in braces that look very similar to that. Um, you know, that my feet were actually bolted together at night while I slept. I can remember trying to uh, hobble around uh, in the house with those with these braces on my legs and my parents uh, being teary-eyed. Um, at the sight of it, I wasn't, um, you know, as a child, I just remember being frustrated by what is this thing on my legs here. So, yeah, um, maybe that's the reason that I couldn't do the skipping. Uh, maybe that's all part of the same story. So, I guess my point in bringing this up, it's a little bit of a flashback, and this one, I'm going to keep this one very short, is that uh, we all have pluses and minuses that we deal with in our lives, uh, you know, things that we have no control over. Obviously, I didn't have any anything to say about this physical condition, um, you know, when I was very young, requiring such drastic, um, you know, things, so bolting my legs together, basically. Uh, so, yeah, you know, it's a point system. I say, I've said this my whole life, pretty much, um, that I think it's like a video game. You have uh, 100 points, and they're distributed across various things, and when you have more in one category, you have less in another category, seems to be the way it works. But anyhow, um, it didn't uh, didn't didn't change the direction of my life, at least as far as I know. I didn't have to wear those things in school. I, that was before I actually got into school. But nonetheless, you know, we all have our things to deal with. I guess that's my main point. So nobody's perfect. Uh, anybody who claims to be or pretends to be is lying, plain and simple. Um, most people try to hide these kinds of things if they have them in their backstory. I just don't think that's honest. Um, you know, I think it's more valuable to bring these things out, tell the stories. So anyway, that's it for today. Uh, thanks for your time. If you'd like to support this work or and or uh, keep up with the resources, look down in the in the show notes in the bottom. Thank you, and I'll speak with you again in two weeks. Bye now.